Hi everybody, um, this is the look for today, I know a long time no see, um, anyways, it is just a dark kind of brown, uh, well dark, green and, green and purple look, I don't know what I'm going to name it, but, um, this is what it is, let me zoom you guys in really fast, so it's like a dark, um, brownish green on the lid, and then a purple in the crease. Really simple, really, really, really simple, trust me. It's only those two colors and the highlight, so. Hope you guys enjoyed, stay tuned for the video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, Bye. guys, let's get started. Um, I already primed my eyes with Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and then I put <clears throat> Black Ground Paint Pot. Um, and it's just a black one. All over my um, lid area, a little past the crease. The easiest way I found to put on um, paint pots, especially dark paint pots, because they can kind of get messy and it's noticeable, is using a two, no, yeah, 217 brush. So it's kind of the fluffy, flattish one though. So you see it's kind of flat. So that helps. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to use is a pigment, and it's the brown, green brown pigment. Yeah. And it's just that brown one with kind of green um, a reflex kind of thing. So, anyways, I'm just going to put that all over my lid. Using it dry, so make sure you pat on to the lid first. Or you blend. So I'm just going to pat that all over. So pat first and then worry about the blending later. So just about till your eye socket. This is a really, really easy look. So don't be intimidated. Okay, so that's you have that. Then I'm gonna take um, a fluffy blending brush and I'm gonna go in with push the edge and it is a purple color. Um, see if you guys can see this without me dropping it. And then it's a pigment. Um, it's limited edition, dish, bleh, limited edition, so I don't know if it's still out, but any dark purple color will do. So I'm just gonna swirl my brush in there. I'm just going to put that on the outer corner, so kind of drawing the V first. And it's a really intense color, so you don't need a lot. And I'm just going to go in circular motions. And then bring it in this way. Concentrating on the outer V though. Okay, next I'm gonna use Soba, the brown, the brown color I always use to blend out things. So it's this one right here. And I'm gonna use another fluffy brush and I'm just gonna blend out these harsh lines and also blend up. For highlight today, I'm going to be using Mylar, which is this color right here, the one I hit pan on. I'm just using a flat brush, just going to highlight my brow bone. So that is actually it guys, I told you it's a really easy look but it's really pretty. Um, I'm going to line my eyes and put on my mascara and then I'll be right back. Alright guys, this is the final look. Um, so I did my face and I'll let you know what's on there. Um, for foundation I just used my Mineralized Skin Finish Natural. For um, bronzer and contouring I used the Warm Blend Mineralized Skin Finish. For blush, I use the Love Rock Mineralized Blush. And then for highlight, I used 
the Stila Convertible, no, Stila Illuminating Finishing Powder in gold. Okay? So, on my lips, I will use. Let's go for. Let's go for what neutral can I use today? I'll use high tea. Okay, and the lip gloss I'll use. This is Moth to Flame Dazzle Glass. Alright, and that's the finished look. So, hope you guys enjoyed, and um, I'll be doing a vlog soon, so look out for that. Bye, guys!